Yeah, give me just a second. And Fluky, uh, sorry, go ahead. No, go ahead. I'd say Fluky, you got, you got four people. Uh, sorry, I'm late. All right, listen. Oh, I, need uh, I think I got three. Three. We have a full 16. Stand yeah, by so Jigsaw. We should, we should probably just drop that, um, or let the AI fly it or whatever, that southern bar cap. Yeah, I figured it's the AI. Jigsaw, you're on CS mode, you're good to go. And I think we're good. So everyone, or just slot into everything above. Don't slot in the serpent, slot into everything else. Your muscles, we have one slot open, also in Python. Okay. Okay, let's do it. All right, welcome to UAF session 358, Double Oka. Our forces continue to push uh, forward in the Sinai. Enemy aircraft from Abu Sawir and Fa Faid. God, these are terrible All right, listen names up. to pronounce. Uh, are again harassing our forces during our support of ground forces. We need to remove these air bases from play. We lost some friends to fighters from these air bases yesterday, or uh, last time out. It's personal now. So we'll have uh, five ship Fury, or well, four, I guess, because server one's going to be AI. Fury one is a four ship F 16D Oka on Abu Sawar. Lobo one is a four ship F 16D Oka on Faid. Panther 1 is a 4-ship F-16D seed on Abu Sawar, looking for the AA battalion that's got a fire can at the end of the runway. Uh, Python 1 is a 4-ship F-16C, the northern bar cap. Uh, Python 1, your, your primary job will be to look for scramblers from Abu Sawir and uh, anything coming from the north and the west. Uh, Abu Sawir has got F-16s on it, so you'll have to be... Um, you know, paying close attention there. Uh, Faid's got F4s. Honestly, if they scramble F4s, I'm not too worried about them. I think we can get in, hit the airbase, and then kill the F4s ourselves. But uh, we'll see. That's it. It's a pretty simple mission. I don't think there's much else to say, really. Weather clear. Uh, we take off at 07, 05. Uh, yeah, that's about it. All right. All right. Listen up. Take package. Do we know if these SA-3s are actually active, the ones that are in the briefing? I do not believe that they are. I looked around, like, from the red All point right, of view when up. I was making this, and I did not see them. Okay, let's change the cap duration. Okay, package brief. I'm gonna make this quick, super easy mission. We're package two seven seven five nine. All right, listen up. Flight order as follows: Fury one Oka for Abu, led by Fluky. Fluky, do you have a full four? I do. Lobo one Oka for Faid, led by Brainly. Do you have a full four? Uh, nope. Okay. Panther one number three is Seed, led by Kraus. Do you have a full four? Yes. And Python 1 is, I guess, just the, the only bar cap led by myself, and we are full four. It's Brainling, you're missing your minus one. Minus two. Minus two. Need another one. I'm in the seat. I could leave that, or leave flat and go. Well, we have people to fill all four flights, so. Love Let's get are someone. Are flying today? I am flying. I'm having some problems connecting. Is anyone Jigsaw? Have you taken a seat, Jigsaw? I don't. Okay, take uh, Lobo One with Brandling. Up. Can someone add a Python? Anyone in a Python want to take a, an Oka so we can uh, fully fill the Oka? I don't mind. Want to do it? Okay. Do you mean lead it? Oh no, no, no! You'll be my number seat. three. Okay, right, sorry. Which fl which flight? Lobo one. Stand by. On Brainling. Okay, Lawman, when you're able to connect, uh, join on Python one. 
Uh, can you confirm the IV IP address, All please? Right, one eight eight three nine one five seven three eight. That's correct. You're the correct theater. Israel eighty. Uh, yep. Okay. Anything wrong with the package brief? Situation is morning. Weather is clear. Time takeoff will be 7.07 .07 on the first flight. Takeoff order. Stand by. We're going to have Python 1 first in order. Panther 1, what's your takeoff time? Uh, it's fucking... 7.05? 7.05. You're taking off first. Okay, you're taking off first, followed by Python, then Fury, and then last is Lobo. Yeah, so I had all the people going to Abu Sawir take off first because they have father to fly. Okay, would you be gotcha. repeat that for me, Gus? Apologize. Okay, yeah, takeoff order is Panther, the Seed first, then the Barcap second, and then the first, the the third and takeoff will be Fury one, and then the last to take off is Lobo one. So just announce on the ground when you're taxi and when you're holding short and when you're taking active uh, flight leads. Let's say that in Tower Kong, yes, sir. Okay. Succession of command with myself and Kraus, and then one of the Okas take over after that. Kraus, you're on backup duty for air to air. Just be ready. Roger. Which uh, cap did we kill out of Python and Serpent? We killed Serpent. Roger. What's the TOT for the uh, bar cap? The one that's capping uh, Baid. I'm gonna hit. F I'm gonna hit Abu's uh, over, over the other one, the AI. And by. I set it up so that you guys should you the bar cap should be at your uh, the uh, Fury One's IP as Fury One is getting to their IP. Okay, they're going to cross Suez at 7:30. Their TOT is uh, 0731. Yeah, they're, they're going to be crossing right over the Suez at, at 7.30. Exactly. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Okay, so I think I'm there for like three or four minutes before them. That will uh, mean we're going to definitely have to fight F4s. Yeah, we're there for four minutes, three minutes before the first cap gets there. So that that's probably fine, but um, it would be good if we moved our TOT or we can just uh, drag them. We... No, we'll cross. I'm gonna I'm gonna cross the Suez at seven thirty as well. Yeah, but my TOT is zero zero seven twenty seven. I'm three minutes ahead of you. Can we change it to me being one minute ahead of you? Yeah, do that. Pump pump it up. All right. So instead of seven oh five, do a seven oh six. Yep. And that, then we're hit the same time. All right, listen up. All right, Ground listen up. Triple A. The seed will, which is tasked for that AAA. We also have some dead SAM sites. Uh, an SA3, the 325th, well, it doesn't have a radar. An SA2 that's nearly destroyed, and an SA3 that only has a launcher, nearly destroyed. It's very unlikely that the SA3, that's uh, right in the middle of the town, if you guys want to reference, it's directly in the middle of the town called the 325th. I'm gonna move the bullseye onto it. Okay, just a little northeast right, of the bullseye. Up. Uh, this may go radar active on the way there. It, it so has no radar. It has no radar, but it could be repaired. Oh, that's a good call, 10 yeah. 10, 15 minutes, we don't know. Just as a backup plan, Kraus, if if this is up, uh, kill yeah, we'll it. fuck it up. Okay. I'm just gonna leave the bullseye there. So it's right on the bullseye. Um, anyway, that's a backup plan. Air threats, we have scrambler, F-16 scramblers out of Abu. F-4 scramblers out of Faid. So Kraus, be ready to, to back us up. Do we know if there's any guns vicinity of either of these air bases? I think there's guns at Abu Swayar, isn't there? There is absolutely guns there, yes. They're running like parallel, I believe, from one of the last missions. Yeah, they're south of like, so if you look at the axis of the runway, they're yep. like southeast of it. I done. All right, we'll fuck them up too. Fire cans mixed in with them. So it's the air threats and the ground threats we're dealing with. 
Possible more air threats to the west or north coming in from Cairo. Uh, we'll deal with those as needed. The main threats are the scramblers. And very likely they will scramble across. Yep. So be ready. Hop on them. I'm ready. Uh, sequence of events. We got the takeoff order. We'll fly, fly carrot to the Suez. And when we hit the IPs, we'll start. Ocus, take your air bases. Seed, kill the uh, AAA. Look for engineers as backup. Python, look for scramblers. Look for uh, anything coming in from Cairo after that. Comms, standard. Fury, Lobo, Panther, Python. One, two, three, four. Set your tackens as well, standard. And I believe we have an AWACS up. We do. Okay, we have an AWACS up. Call sign. Get a call sign. Or I'm glad that was already up because I forgot Chalice. to put one in the air. Chalice one. Chalice one may give us some declare calls. And that's it for the mission. Oka, up to you how you want to deal with the airbase. Just however you want to do it. Go for it. Cross, I got some shit sitting on the northwest corner of my runway. Right there at the end of this strip. I don't know, I don't know what the hell that is. Oh, Abu Like right on the strip. There's, yep. there's, there's, there's enemy there? Yeah, I don't know what that is. I see some trucks that could be towed, uh, or just who knows, I don't this? know. I recon and runway. Oh, yeah, that's weird. What the hell? But I can't see the battalion in the target list. I see what you're talking about. What the hell are those? No idea. I better get out the way. I'm fucking... Oh, yeah, I do see those. That's weird. That's fine. I'll take care of them. Don't worry about it. Right on. No, no, those are just the, those are just the uh, Vassy lights, man. Um, if there's the lights. <laughs> yeah, no. those are the Vazis. Yeah, they are. If you zoom in. I'm not gonna drop a rock eye in there if you want, but uh <laughs> figure the figure they won't need them when after we blow up the runway. Alright, I think that's it for the package. Pretty simple mission. Flight leads, you have a lot of discretion here. How you wanna do your job. It's up to you on your method of attack. Any questions? Uh, Abu Sayar is going, gonna go NOE uh, lay down. Yeah, Lobo will be NOE as well. Sure, I'll be calling IB and I, IP inbound right when I make my left turn onto a final there. Basically northwest of the AAA there. Yep. Alright, listen up. Uh, move down the flight channel, flight 1 through 4 in flight order. All right, listen up. All right, where's Nighthawk at? There he is. All right, boys, uh, we're gonna go over some. We're gonna go over the threat brief, and then we'll go into the game plan. So uh, there was reports of a sky guard um, northeast of the Bullseye vicinity of uh, the 516 Air Defense Battalion. Uh, you guys tracking that? You contact on that battalion? Got it. Can I say the name again? 506. 516. Just 516, northeast, yeah. of, the, northeast got it. of the bullseye. I got it. There's a sky guard west of that by one mile, supposedly. Um, it's probably there because um, we. I remember it shooting at someone at a previous mission, so it's probably there. Um, we're going to kill that. That's going to be one target we're going to kill. There is also potentially, well, not potentially. We, we have a high confidence that there is a AAA battalion southeast of Abu Sayyar, just outside of the fence line. Uh, we believe they're parallel to the runway. Um, then we have multiple SAMs, medium altitude SAMs to the west. Uh, you have an SA-6 vicinity of Al Zagazig. Um, if you look, just go west of Steer 6, the first, uh, you'll see an airbase there on the on the fringe of uh, Cairo. There's an SA-6 there, there's two SA-3s to the west of it, and then there is an SA-3 to the south um, in the urban sprawl of uh, Bill Bays. On the west side of that urban sprawl, there's an SA-3. Mark all those. I believe those are the only SAM factor over there. I think the other ones by the edge of the Cairo have been destroyed. Yeah, they're all destroyed. Hey. That sky guard, uh, what what's that roughly equivalent to? It's a uh, sort of like an SA-13. Um, 
it's, it's worse than an SA-13. I'd say it's like a really poorly performing SA-13. Like, uh, it's a... Gotcha. Yeah, it's pretty shitty. Um, Shouldn't be that crap, but it is. I think the ceiling on... Actually, let's go to the air... De let's go to the uh, air defense reference and look it up. I think the ceiling on that thing is pretty ass. I think it's like 12,000 feet or something. It will show up as a P on your RWR, which will scare the shit out of you. It's going to be a P with a dot on the top. There's like no information in the fucking tactical ref, man. Fuck. I'm looking at the, the vault. I don't think it's in the vault. I've got the vault printed out. It's not here. What's I got it. Skyguard radar. It's, uh, what do you want to know? Everything. Like, tell me, um, it's a, it's a radar missile, right? It's based on an AIM-7 or something? Yeah, destroy a Skyguard radar to neutralize the Skyguard site. And uh, it's uh, radar lock range 13 miles, minimum altitude 0 feet, and shaft vulnerability low. What's the ceiling on it? Mm, ceiling. I don't see it. Uh, it's so, weird. It's, so it's a 13 mile range? It's actually pretty far. That's like a SA 3 basically. Yeah, again, the missiles in game are kind of crap. Yeah. It's something I put down that we need to fix, but we never did. It says, it says radar lock range. I mean, that doesn't say. Okay. okay. Okay, so yeah, it's it's probably like half of that then. So I'm using a man pads threat steer for that. Um, it's also a bit confusing because there's two Ismalias in the in the uh, target list. So what I've done is I put a man pads threat steer west of uh, that. 516, and then I put another air defense steer, another man pad steer west of Ismalia on the east side of the town. Because there are two Ismalias in the political threat list, because reasons, I don't know why. So put put um, put the man pad threat steer next to both of those. Like, there, just find the Ismalia in the political list, and there's two of them, but put the man pad threat steer one mile west of both of those, because that's what it said in the briefing. All right, so uh, what weapons do, we, do you guys want to use? We're going to need a combination of um, CBUs and probably, well, actually, yeah. I, I'd like one guy to have maybe strikes, but everyone else can carry CBUs or, or maybe GBU-15s. So what do you guys want to use? Basically, you can basically pick whatever you want as your loadout, and I'll set it. I'm good with my loadout. What do you have? Six Mark 20s. Um, all right, I'm going to set a centerline tank, so uh, that's also going to happen, so that might make you a little too heavy. That, sure you got strikes. Um, yeah, if that's what you want, I mean, I'll take whatever, although I'm not really... Um, I have no practice with the GBU-15s, so okay. it should be strikes or uh, CBUs. Okay. Um, were well, you willing to carry a pair of strikes? Yeah, that's fun. Um, or maybe maybe we'll get you a strike and a pair of Mavericks. How about that? That would work as well. All right, so I'm going to give you uh, one AGM-45, two AGM-65 Bravos, and then I'm thinking of rolling with uh, GBU-15s. Yeah, I'm going to go with. I think I'm going to go GBU-15s. Before I forget, what's our TAC in? Um, it's a uh, four, whatever. Uh, hold on a second. Third flight down, 13 yeah, X-ray. Hmm, you think I should go with GBU-15s or you think I should go with bombs and shit? <laughs> Up to you. I know, it's such I a don't hard know choice, though. Are you going to have time to actually guide that GBU down? Yeah, there's time to do that. It's fine. Is GBU-15 is a, is a capability that is pretty strong. You basically find something and using the optic and then blow blow it up, like guaranteed. The other guys are gonna. Yeah, try, I'm just thinking about air defense. Like if there's F4s floating around, I don't know if you're gonna want to be flying straight and level for that. Well, the escort got to deal with that. Um. Fuck, I don't know what to pick.
I think I'm going to go with the GBU-15s. Fuck it. And uh, let me get my data pod here. All right, boys. So um, let me also set the get target zero points on the SA6 so I can fake that out if I have nothing else to kill. So are we going to split as elements, or are we going to stick I'm, together? I haven't gone right. over the game plan yet. Gotcha. Fucking Ismalia has all this ground ground detail that's gonna make it hard to find that sky guard. I sent you a screenshot of the threat guide. All right, so uh, you're you're rolling with six rock eyes as well, gas. Is that what you're getting? It's fine. Is that what you want, or do you want something else? Do you want some Mavericks too? Um, I don't know, really know what we're, uh, how we're doing this exactly. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you a couple Mavericks. All right. Giving you uh, two Mavericks. So we have. Uh, so here's here's the game plan. So. I have two GBU-15s, uh, Nighthawk has six Rock Eyes, Star Fury has a Shrike and two Mavericks, and Gasman has three Rock Eyes and two Mavericks. Okay, so here, here's a game plan. We'll, we'll get airborne, we'll go to medium altitude, um, we'll ingress to Tier 4. It's Tier 4, um, I'll begin to, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, try to find the Sky Guard using, uh, the GBU-15. Um, so let's let's. I need you guys to make these targets to your point. So reference, um, reference the eastern side of Ismalia. Like you know the eastern Ismalia that's in the the urban sprawl by the bridge. Yep. Are you are you tracking that Nighthawk? Mm-hmm. Um, make that um target point. Make a building in there. Steer point eighteen. Make the other Ismalia that's by, um, the other Ismalia that's by, like, the, the west side of town, make that, uh, steer point, uh, 17. Just pick one of the buildings and make it a steer point. And then, um... Hey, hang on, hang on, I gotta find some of this okay. stuff. Okay, so... Alright. The other Ismalia. Yeah, there's two Ismalias in the... As I was saying before, why didn't you guys say something before? Fuck. Go to the... Click Order of Battle. Go, click on Egypt. Go to Political Objectives. Go down to Ismalia, starting with an I. I-S-M-A-I-L-I-A. The first one in the list should be Steer Point 17. It should be on the west side of town. Yeah. The second one in the list should be Steer Point 18. It should be on the east side of town. Please say something if you're not tracking okay, anything. Well yeah, because you just flip flopped. I thought the east was steer point seventeen. No, the steer the east, the east yeah. is steer point eighteen. The west is the western one is steer point seventeen. All right, I got it. It's hidden by it was hidden by a triple A thing. Or a... Yeah, I just turned just you know just use the order of battle. Yeah, I got it. Okay, hold on. I've never found stuff in the order of battle like this. Click on order of battle. Let me know when you're in there. Yeah, I got it. Click the Egyptian flag, which is to the left of the Saudi flag on the right side of the screen. Right. I don't know what that looks like. It is a green map with a saber on it. To the left of that is a red box with got a black, it. white, and red. Click on that. Then you'll see a, uh, a menu in there called Objectives. Click on a 
expand that, go to political. Yeah. Then scroll down. It is in alphabetical order. Scroll down to I S M A I L I A. Yep. There's two in the list. The the first one in the list is going to be steer point. You have to like click on it, click find, then recon it. The first one in that list will be steer point 17. The second one in the list is going to be steer point 18. This, and then just go and just like find a random building in there, and make it steer point 17 and steer 18, respectively. I just made the first one start here, so we're on the same page. How about yeah, that? I got it. Okay. So is that done? Because that's going to be important. Because if I say slap shot steer point 17 and you shoot the wrong one, it's it's going to result in me getting shot down by a sky guard. So I want to make sure those are actually set. All right, 17 and 18. Okay, then then go go to the west. Find the SA6 that is. Um, on the edge of uh, the northeast side of Cairo, right next to Zagazig Air, Air Base. Okay, are you are you tracking that? Yeah, that one I got. Okay, make that. Um, what did I say that as? Hold on. Make that steer point 15. And then to the south of that, there is a um, there's an SA3 like stick. Uh, it's it's in the Bill Bay's. Um, Urban sprawl. Just go south, and you'll see Bill Bay's, and then it's on the west side of Bill Bay's. There's an SA3 there. Make that steer point 16. Got it. Okay. So now that all that busy works out of the way, now we can actually go over a fucking game plan. So, um, yeah, medium altitude. When I get to steer four, if I could have um, Star Fury switch into my number two, that would be appreciated. Uh, so if you could just get out of there, Nighthawk, and, and take uh, number three. One. Yeah, so Star Fury going to two. Alright, go ahead, Nighthawk. So, um. Wait, what? What just happened? Well, I don't know what happened. There we go. <laughs> okay, so when we get to Steer 4, I'm gonna try to find the Sky Guard that is vicinity of the. of Steer 17. Yes, I'm going to try to find the Sky Guard at tier point 17. That's where I think it actually is. And, um, I'm going to fucking try to kill it with the GBU-15. Um, meanwhile, I want uh, the element to start just anchor and cap. One minute later, the, the actual cap should arrive. By that point, we should have bombs on target on the Sky Guard. Um, if unable, then we're just going to continue. Um, if we have a positive radar contact on the, if we have a RWR indication of the Sky Guard, we'll fire a strike at it, or we'll try to kill it with the Maverick. Um, then we'll continue, and the element will uh, take lead to Steer Five. We'll overfly Steer Five just north of it. El element will begin to attack guns uh, vicinity of Steer Six. That's going to be led by Nighthawk. That attack will be led by Nighthawk. Tra tracking that Nighthawk. Yep, say again. You're gonna be attack. You're gonna be in controlling the attack on a steer six, the way the guns are. Okay. All right. I'm. We're gonna. Me and Star Fury will be flying support. We'll just be there, like looking for pop ups. We both have like weapons that will re can react to pop ups. So uh, we'll, we have like Mavericks and uh, GBU. So we'll just be dealing with any pop ups that happen, like any Sams that are in the vicinity. Um, once the attack is complete on Steer 6, if I have a GBU left, I'm going to use it on the SA-6, which is, uh, Steer Point, um, 15. And if, uh, for whatever reason, Star Fury has his, uh, Shrike remaining, we'll use it on the SA-3 or the SA-6 to the west. Using, um, using a, uh, EOM, EOM, uh, shot using the, the, sh the Shrike. Um, we'll remain... Play, playing there until all the air defenses are destroyed, or until the uh, Oka is off target, and then we'll RTB. We'll be the last ones off target. Um, important note is that the the fucking uh, Oka will be calling IP inbound. When they call IP inbound, you're to abort whatever your current attack is, and then um, wait until they're off target before we resume attacking the guns. All uh, right, please acknowledge three and four. Uh, yep. yep. 
Okay. Any questions? All right, I'll uh, hop up. Hey, Kraus, you want to um, switch around the loadout again? Oh, shit. Yeah, stand by. Stand by, stand by. Have you seen? Oh yeah, someone saw. Yeah, okay for a sec, but let's do it. Hey, uh, check check your loadout. Uh, two and three. I'm good. Oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, Fury one dark. Uh, can you drop pairs? Yeah, sure. Well, man, you're peer to pure mode. Do you know how to set up CS mode? Well, man? No. Okay. If you look in the channel description for the channel we're in. Yes, sir. It says put this in your Falcon BMS uh, config file. Do you see that? Looking. Okay. Uh, I'll just put it in channel. Just put that at the bottom line of your Falcon uh, BMS.config and it'll force a uh, client server mode. I can't go uh, over it right now, we don't have enough time about what client server really does, but you're gonna have to. Copy and paste that word for word, it's yeah. case sensitive. Copy. Ready for departure. I got you. Panther, ready to check? Uh, two. Three, checking in. Panther, one, four. Panther, one, one, ready to check? Panther, one, four. Panther, one, one, ready to check? Panther, one, four. Ready for departure. Start taxing. I can't hear you. Fury, one three, ready for departure. Fury, one four, ready for departure. Panther, Fury, one Panther, one, one Panther, ready one, for one, departure. One, check, uh, Victor three. Fury, Victor one two, three. ready for departure. Get five by five. Uh, Panther, Panther, one. Never be my poach. Two okay. nine nine two. I lead. What was uh, my attacking again? Uh, Eleven Yankee, or how did he set it up? No, you should be, um, you should be 74, no, 76 Yankee. Two should be 76 X-Ray. Four should be 13 Yankee. Got it. Four. Two good yardstick. I have negative yardstick with you, too. Python, 1-4, ready for departure. Python, 1-1, ready for departure. Fury, 1-1, is having control. Python, 1-3, ready for departure. Taking, uh, taking active right. Python, 1-2, ready for departure. Fury, 1-1, one, one, taxi, runway 0 two left. Fury, 1-1. One, one. Never team Do a four ship departure. I'll uh, pull her into 350, rejoin the wedge. Fury is taxi. 1-1. Never team Bell, Taxi clear of the runway. Fury, one, two. Never team power. You're cleared for takeoff. Runway zero two left. Fury, one, three. Never team power. Taxi clear of the runway. Panther, one, three. Never team power. Taxi clear of the runway. One set. Panther, one, four. Never team power. Taxi clear of the runway. Two set. Two set. Brakes on, run it up. Brakes off now. Full burn now. Alright, four, run it up. Panther's rolling. Lobo, one three, ready for departure. Lobo, one four, ready for departure. Tower, who's thinking uh, I can run up? Uh, be advised, this is an AI. Uh, one, one. Panther, one one. Never team tower. Resume all navigation. Panther, one two. Never team tower. Taxi clear of the runway. Panther, one three, ready for departure. Lobo, one four, ready for departure. Panther, one three, ready for departure. Panther, one four, ready for departure. Panther, one three, ready for departure. Pan
team tower. Resume all navigation. Answer, one three. Have a team tower. Resume all navigation. Fury, one two. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Fury, and that's why I always three. take off Never on the right tower. runway. Position and hold. Fury, one four. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Fury, Fury one down burn. Have a team tower. Wait for departure. Taxi now. Answer, one four. Have a team tower. Taxi clear of the runway. One down to the burn, six degrees north. One four. Have a team tower. Resume all navigation. Logo, one two. Ready for departure. Serpent, one one. Ready for departure. Panther one, uh, left Logo, is tier three. One one. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Uh, disregard. Left is tier two. Logo, one two. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Logo, one three. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Logo, one four. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Python, one one. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Python, one two. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Fury, one three. Have a team tower. Taxi clear of the runway. Fury, one three. Have a Jalus, one Panther, one one. Request picture. Fury, one four. Have a team tower. Position and hold. Fury, one one. Yeah, bring it down for the three three zero for the rejoin. Runway zero two left. Fury, one four. Have a team tower. Someone's oh, already rejoined. Traffic, uh, level check. Fury, one, two. Visual. Team Resume all navigation. Uh, flight one, push uniform seven. Fury, one, one. Fury, Fury, team Resume all navigation. Fury is pushed. Two. Answer, one, one. Chalice, one. Fisher is multiple groups. Nearest bandit to bullseye, zero, five, five. One hundred eighty miles. Uh, fence in, leads fence, one, two, eight. Uh, music on. Chalice, one, two. I believe there was just a group of bandits uh, to our uh, two o'clock where they were splashed. Also looks like we're gonna have to change out in there two nine or nine or two. Yep. Uh, yeah, one set. Jalus, one Panther, one one. Request picture. Panther, one one. Jalus, one. Fisher is multiple groups. Nearest bandit to bullseye zero five five. One hundred eighty miles. Back in the screw, 1 1 checking in uniform 17. We are currently three good ships. Uh, my force should be uh, checking in momentarily. Python 1, Panther. Python 1, checking in. You from 17, four good ships. Python, Panther, uh, uh, request picture. Check, check, uh, bandits to the northeast, 45 miles. Python 1, checking. Wait, one. Alright boys, let's level off and pick up some speed so we can get back on carrot. I'm gonna kick in the burner for about five seconds.
them out. Panther 1, Python 1, Bandits or two are northeast around Tel Aviv. Uh, they're being dealt with. Panther, uh, Panther check weapon power. Two is currently powering Mavericks. Panther reference tier three. We're going to check uh, left is tier 4. Reference tier 4. Uh, 3A over shadow. You a little bit lead? Yeah, I'm heavier than you guys, so I'm going to be a little bit slower. I'm going to level off 20,000 and we'll stay at mill power. Scan low. How are you doing it? Jalus, one Panther, one one. Declare. Shark two two. Buddy fight. Panther, one one. Chalice. Traffic, 
Panther 1, Python 1. Panther. What's your delta? Oh, we're on tech, we're on carrot. Say again? On carrot. On carrot. Fury 1, say delta. On carrot. And level 1, say delta. This is an example of completely unnecessary comms on the, on the, on the guard channel, by the way. Get back, it's wrong, Carrot, continue. That added a lot of value, huh? Are you guys able to hold this speed? Too good. Three will, it's just we're accelerating very slowly. I think I have less drag, but I'm a bit heavier. Chalice, one, answer, one, three, declare. Answer, one, three, Chalice, one, contact is friendly. So three, what's your, what's going to be your game plan when you attack those guns? What's your method of attack? Alright. So, as far as I can tell, we're going to wait till you... Go in and make sure there's no fire can, no sky guard, then we're gonna roll in. We're gonna observe the airbase probably from over the Suez if we can see anything, line up and uh, roll in basically for our medium to high altitude CCIP dive bomb attack. What's gonna be your direction of a, your ingress direction and egress direction? Alright, uh, probably gonna be ingressing from the east to the northeast. We're gonna come off left and egress out east. All right. I rather you come. I rather you ingress from the southeast, but I don't want you to overfly is Malia. Okay, understood. And then you said you're gonna do medium altitude uh, dive bomb. Is that what you're doing? Thank you, Avram. Chalice one Panther one one request picture. Panther one one Chalice one picture clear. Alright, four, let's kick in the burner for about 10 seconds here. At what, what speed can you, can you keep? Don't, don't burn if you don't have to. Alright, from... The, it's kinda hard to tell because we're slowly accelerating, it's just taking a while. Just, just keep in mill power and you can lag behind a little bit. Alright, from... Two, are you good? Two's good. We're accelerating through 380 right now. Alright, I'm, on, I'm only at 340, so you, you should be able to catch up. Hey, from. Python contact bandit 055 for 026 21000 uh, flank flank south. Lobo 12 buddy spike. Okay guys, uh, just to the north of steer 4 there's uh, two bandits at 21000. Panther 1, uh, contact faded. Panther 1 1, Chalice 1, Victor 1 1, I'm clear. Him, he's flanking left. Uh, Angel 21. Update bulls, please. Bull 069025. Chalice 1, Panther 1 3, declare. Panther 1 3, he's Chalice nose, 1, contact is friendly. Bravo 1 3, Chalice 1, Victor 2 1. I got him now. 3 is, uh, Telling. Uh, one's contact. 
care, correction, contact. Okay, we're going to go one one. Uh, check left, check left, retrograde, retrograde, uh, southwest, southeast. Okay, uh, Panthers retrograding southeast. Uh, bandits are hot now, confirmed F4. They go in the burn, I'm, I'm spike F4. Okay, 25 degrees nose down, reference uh, 125. Full burn. Panthers defending 125, uh, Angel 17, uh, we're spiked. Two switch flies, I'm on your fold. Okay, check left. Check left to heading uh, zero 09 or zero. Keeping the burn. Two you visual. Two visual, what's your six? Roger, I'm um, in a slight climb. Python 1 to gauge defensive bandit bullseye 069033 21000, flank north. Pan uh, Panther's playmate. All right, check left. We're going to go in and support uh, Python. Panther, second group behind them at 24,000, bullseye 087015. Four, you still right behind me? Four, one, you're left. Panther's in from the southeast. Four, go ahead and go trail. Chalice, one, Panther, one, one, declare. Panther, one, one, Chalice. One contact confirmed hostile. There's a group at 11,000 11, cold. 7,000 now. Three, say, say distance to tier three. I'm on. Distance tier three is 16. One, one. Understood. I'm I'm about three miles ahead of you. Python say status. Python is too far to engage. Python is 20 miles. We're pressing in still. There's a second group behind. Them. Say say. Lead. Zero seven seven zero two two angels twenty five hot. Yeah, I'm contact. Python say no, engine. Python is engaged offensive. Panther assist. Yeah, say, say group, say the bullseye. We're engaging group 04503, second group to the south at 25,000. Okay, Panther is engaged, uh, 071024, 25,000. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna engage the group of 24,000, kick in the burner. Three. Two separating left. I'm sorted on the lead. Package, we got a third group behind him at 17,000, 08, 015. Alright, I'm just gonna sort on the rear group unless you need assistance on the front. No, support on the front group is pro we're probably gonna have to go defensive. They're probably at force. Understood. Okay, I'm keeping in the burn now. I think they're going to they're going to support the other group that's being engaged. I'd recommend the other flight gets out of there. Two sort on the sort on the trail at twenty three thousand. Two sort of trail. I'm a spiked for uh, nose. They're jamming. I lost. Four tally two. Python one two five zero three. Status uh status trail two. Two status trail. Uh, yeah, two sorted trailer. Yeah, what's the status on the trail? What's the status on the trail, Bandit? Or tally two, they will turn uh, cold. Okay, I'm uh, I'm coming off right. Two two come off right. Three continue. Two off right. Pan two present. They're cold. Eighteen thousand. Roger. Rear group is jamming. 
They're flanking. Two reference zero nine zero. Two. Leave traffic nine high. Okay. Do you need a flow zero nine zero? Get up the angle. I'm at two, still pressing. Three, three, don't go too deep in there. Yeah, four, uh, three, four is tied. Uh, Lobo is already on our way. We have a window. We're gonna proceed as frag and then join that fight. Okay, uh, three's in from the east. Or disregard, one's in from the east. Hey, I'm visual on you. Panther 1 in from the east. Panther 1, Panther 1. Where's tied with 3's at you? Yep, that's me. Alright, I'll intro. 3's in status. Serpent 1-4, mighty fight. Three's three say status. Uh, pressing due west. Uh, we're probably about 5 miles from the top. From the, uh, canal. Roger. Chalice 1, Panther 1-1, one, one, declare. Chalice 1, Panther 1-3, declare. Panther 1-3, Chalice 1, contact declare. Still getting multiple F4s tonight. Friendlies are at Panther Angel one, 17, one, damning. 047026. Can we say again? Sorry. One moment. Hi, I'm getting nailed for pretty close. I'm gonna break off left here. What's your altitude? Four one o'clock. Kelly two. A firm. Four, uh, three say altitude. Angels twenty and dot falling. Four. Fifteen thousand right. Kelly up four. Alice, one Panther, one one. Kelly up five of them now. Uh, Alright, someone's smoking. Kelly, Kelly, two of them diving down. Yeah, I see him, I see him. We got an F-16 chasing on him. Cody Spike, Cody Spike. Three, say your bullseye. Uh, unable. Well, say, al say altitude. 15. I got one. Cody Spike, left in front of are you engaging that force? I'm following you. Yeah, I'm engaging. I'm with you. Through Panther. Panther 1, Fox 2, Fox 2, Fox 4, right into an A5. Alright, it's flash back. Chalice 1, Panther 1, 1, declare. Panther 1, 1, Chalice 1, contact. I think all that force got flashed to 4. 4. Three, three flow out to the uh, southeast. Hey, friend. I'm going to clear your six. Hey, Angels. Uh, 14 and climbing. Contact. Package, picture clear. Are you, are you eastbound right now? Uh, coming southeast. Yep, Con you're at 17 now. 15. Okay, contact. Right on the quad. Four's with you. Chalice, one, Panther, one, Two, are you one, visual? Two visual, seven, four. Panther, one, one, Chalice, one, picture clear. Alright, flow on steer four. Bunch of aircraft at 1,000. Oh, that's them probably. Uh, Panther 1 1 buddy lock. Okay. 
uh, I'm reference, uh, okay, all flight reference tier 4. Tier 4. Mud 2, right 1 o'clock. Okay, flight safe fuel. Two fuel zero seven liner. Three zero eight zero. Four zero eight seven. Five miles from IP. I said three uh, caps tier four. Uh, I'm inbound on tier seventeen. Panther Python. Uh, actually, disregard. Um, three continue and attack uh, tier six. Panther go. We got a we got a mobile sky guard somewhere between uh, Abu and Faiz. Two, uh, let's try to find that sky guard. Copy. Uh, try to find them once you do your primary. Copy. S uh, three, did you copy my last? Negative, you step on. Three, uh, continue and attack steer six. Pressing. Make sure you come in from the southeast, though. Do not egress from the east. Okay, Panther Python, possible position of, uh, of sky guard just east of Abu. Roger, uh, lurking. Hey, uh, two, get re get your strike ready. Two. Uh, put, make sure you got the sky guard selected. Uh, which table is that on? I've got a bunch of search radars. Unknown. I got mud AAA left 10 o'clock. Come right, come right, come right. Global one is Dakota, airbase destroyed. We're going to uh, orbit in case we're needed for air to air. Might just have to wait till it's in has mode and see what it actually is. Might be a P. I also have a mud two left ten o'clock. I have a, a mud two to the uh to the southwest, pretty close. Two same. Uh, two has that one on the HAS. Stand by. I'm looking for the uh, looking for that sky guard. Two. Do you, were you able to get it? Were you able to get it too? Uh, negative. I got searched. Radars, but uh, that's all I see. Okay, uh, three. I have I have contact on a very large uh, column AAA. They're they're to the um, they're right across the threshold on the right side of the threshold uh, by the large radar boom. You should be able to attack and destroy the destroy in one pass. There's a massive column of AAA there. Hey, friend, I'm scanning for it. They're um, in fact, I may just mark them and attack them. Okay, I'm Mud Skyguard, right one o'clock. Two, you're unable to engage, right? Two enable. Shit, okay. Switch to the Maverick and get ready. Got Mud Triple A nose. Okay, I'm coming left, coming left out of that Triple A. Two, Maverick's on. Wait, can you walk me on, on the Triple A? Yeah, so reference the thresholds. Um, stand by. Stand by. I have I have a shitload of mud AAA. I'm trying to avoid. Package both Abu and Fight are clear scramblers. For traffic twelve. Go out. Okay, in in hot on steer six.
I'm off. I'm off to the. It's a, it's across the threshold that's facing us. They're uh, oriented like in a big diagonal. You should see them when you come when you roll in. Attack from the uh, east, or like a short final on east. You should take them. Hey, from defending AAA. Four tally. All right, four. We're gonna come line up here. Let's climb up the two four. I'm gonna take the far side. Yeah, I'll take the far side. Skyguard's active. Leave two, I got that Skyguard on RWR at 10 o'clock. Yeah, understood, but uh, you can't take it out, right? Negative. So we're just gonna have to roll. Two, be on the lookout, I'm, I'm in hot on the airbase. Helmet 2 is hot on the airbase, about 5 seconds out from our drop, well, from our dive. Shit, I'm off, I'm off hot. Okay. No, three, 3, continue, 3, continue, I'm off hot. Sagan, you want me to come off? No, attack, attack. Alright, attacking. Four's uh, in on the near, near part of the column. Hey, friend. Cap, flare. Python. Uh, Lobo has about two minutes of play time. Uh, go ahead and RTV. Panther is attacking Abu Sayyar. Time now. Hawkeyes! 311 is currently... Hawkeyes! 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 Four Stinger Skyguard. Two, look to the left, look for a sand. Uh, no. Two looking, no visual. Altitude. Altitude. We're defending. Oh, Tally Sam, uh, nose. Uh, two Sams in the in inbound. Uh, two, come, uh, uh, four, come right, four, come right. On our nose, two Sams in the air. Two blind, coming off right. Uh, four, br four break left now. The sky guard, you get a tally on the site? Negative. Hold on. Uh, three, flow, one, one, one. Three, flowing, one, one, one. Three, uh, are you, are you, are you Winchester or are you able to reattack? I am Winchester. Understood. Uh, good. Uh, other flights running in on the airbase, I think. Fury, are you are you in hot? Stand by. Okay. I'm gonna right. Two, I'm gonna right hand turn. Uh, two's on your six. Yeah. Uh, you're clear to engage with Mavericks. Right now. You're clear to engage on Mavericks on the on guns that are remaining. Other flight is attacking the target. Give them 30 seconds. Four, four, what is your status? Four is uh, clean, and I probably over my bomb, so I'm uh, east of east of east. <laughs> Correction, I'm uh, just northwest of Bayou. Sam launch, Abu. Someone's hit at Abu. Bruiser. Altitude. Right, Altitude. I'm sorry, we got one, two, and three off. Abu flown out on egress. Uh, possibly number four got hit. We got a parachute at Abu. Disregard. Four is up. We're all on egress. Three, say your position. I am flowing 
120 from Steer 6. Yeah, we got a parachute east side of Abu. Not that Angel's 20. I can try to make a run on uh, Steer 6 with my bombs. I don't know if they're worked out. What's your max G? Hey, uh, bruiser away, bruiser away on the on the group that's right by the uh, threshold. I'm on left hand turn defending AAA. Lead two is off left. No visual on actual AAA launcher. It's got a bunch of trucks. Yeah, wait for my wait for my splash. Uh, Thirty seconds. Package all time. Three on one Miller. Okay, uh, impact in like two seconds. Impact now. Uh, visual. Boom. All right, let's regroup. Tier seven. Four, four. Do you want to try? Uh, do you want to try to attack? Oh yeah, I can try. Just try to do it. Just try to do a loft so you so you stay outside of the sky guard. Alright, I'm turning back in the support. Okay. Two status. Uh, two's at your seven. Head good visual on your impact. I see the rest of the launchers. Alright, uh... Rock I'm gonna extend out one five five, then you're clear to attack. Four rock eyes on the column. Hey, tally the sky guard. Tally the sky guard. Uh, check, check uh, our left. Uh, Nine o'clock. Uh, the southwest corner of uh, of Ismalia, right to the uh, right of a depot. Uh, two, uh, two. Are you contact? Uh, I believe so. I see an engineer down there. There's an engineering battalion, maybe. Two, follow me. Two, follow me. Watch. Halfway in between steer five and six, so I'll keep an eye out for launches. Two. Uh, I'm up at Angels. Two, three. Clear, clear comms. Stop. Clear comms. Two, uh, two on my nose. Altitude. Um, Altitude. Two on my nose, right by the depot. There's a sky guard there. Bruiser. Uh, bruiser away. I'm off to the left. Uh, those those big triple launchers? They're they're to the um, reference the reference the, the fucking depot. They're to the they're to the right of the depot. SA nines in the area. SA nines south to the to the east of the target. No missile launches from them. But just keep it keep that in mind. Making one last pass with rock eyes on the call. Hey, friend. Okay, I'm in terminal on the battalion. Two status. I two. Lead two. I'm not sure what you're telling me to look at. I don't know where the hell the depot is. Okay, uh, flow out uh, 210 and then look for splash over your left wing. You see a splash momentarily. So, you know where Ismelia is? Do you have a contact on Ismelia? Uh, A-firm, big city, right? Yes, a big city, so there be, should be a massive explosion there. A-firm, visual. Okay, the the launcher, I think that's the Skyguard Battalion, I think. And I think I may have killed the radar. I'm going to run in with my jammer off and we'll see. I've got two launchers at the end of that, um, that... I'm still spike Skyguard. Okay, understood. I'm looking for the fucking... Maybe that's not... Maybe that wasn't that. Yeah, the radar's going to look a lot like a fire cam. 
Yeah, I thought I saw it, but maybe it was something else. Um, look. I think that's an FA-3 battalion. Okay, knock it off. Uh, uh, two, uh, two say fuel. Two full zero five nine. Get yeah, us in your tanks and uh, let's try to find and kill the Sky Guard. I really want to kill this. I think it's on the western. The correction, it's on the eastern side of town. Two jettison. It should be to the north somewhere. Yeah, I'm scanning for it. It's a cold, it's cold launch. Rock eyes! Caution. Caution. It's cold launch, so it's hard to see. Four rock eyes on the battalion. I'm headed towards the sky guard, uh, now. Mr. Six. Look with my Mavericks and see. Alright, I'm, I'm in hot, uh, zero, one, zero. One, three, Looking. One, contact is friendly. Yeah, it's somewhere to the north. It's got to be on the north side of Ismalia somewhere. Hey, I got another battalion uh, just to the north of Ismalia on that L-shaped road that's coming out to the left. I see some vehicles to the northeast of that road. Yeah, just be advised, there's like, at this on a minimum of six SA-7 positions and four SA-9s right there. Understood, but we have Mavericks. You see the truck, the vehicles moving to the east of Ismalia, right in that little depot area? Stand by, I'm looking. Hold on, I'm, I'm coming off left, defending AAA. Uh, stand by. Two, were you, were, were you tally on those, on those vehicles that just called out? There's, on the north side of Ismalia, there's an L-shaped road. Negative. Okay, look at Ismalia. Look on the north side of Ismalia. There's one road coming out of the city. It's an L-shaped road. A firm, I think. Okay, so to, to the northeast of that road is a series of vehicles in the open, about one mile. Yeah, I think I may be a sky guard as well. I'm looking at it now. Yeah, so gas man, I'm gonna vector you onto there. I, I'm, I don't know where you guys are. Okay, reference is Malia. You guys have to know where his Malia is, otherwise this isn't gonna work. Yep, yeah, I got it, I got it. So, four. Do you have the visual on the big airbase that's on fire? Are you talking Steer 17 or 18? Alright, let's do Steer 17. Find his Malia, the big town. Call tally. I'm directly over steer 17. Okay. Hold on. Right, so should be right below you then. Four. Do, do, do you see the massive town? Okay. Reference steer point 17. It's, the vehicles are just north of steer point 17. They're in the open. They're like two. They're like a mile north of steer point 17. I'm gonna fucking go in there and gun him if you guys don't get a contact soon. I'll support you on that. Just, just, like, look... Do you guys see the town? Just say yes or no. Yeah, there's lots of towns, Gross. No, it's in Malia. It's the thing we briefed. It's a massive town. It's 0.17. Do you have a contact? Yeah, I said I was right over it. Okay, reference the, reference the one road that's going out of the town to the north. There's one road. It's an L-shaped road that bends to the west. I see about 20 roads. Okay, reference to town, find the big blob of normal looking dirt in the center of town. Move your eyes towards where the Mediterranean is, you'll see one road on the on the side of the town that's closer to the two air bases. Dude, are you visual with anyone, gas man? We'll just guide you on that way. No, I'm not visual with anyone. Okay, reference uh Let's get a rejoin and then we'll. We, we gotta get out of here though soon. Okay, uh, go go to Abu Sayyar, which is here point six, and you're, you're gonna rejoin visually there, and then I'll, I'll walk you onto the target. The 
this is where you want data link. No, we just need people to fucking listen during the briefing. Okay, I'm overflying uh, steer six now. I'm at Angels 15. I'm gonna turn my jammer off. Call contact. I'm pretty sure that's it. Four call contact, I'm over steer six. Uh, contact, Angel 17. Okay, follow me. What's your distance? That's 10 miles. I said. What's your, what's your, what direction are you coming from? From the, uh, from where we were the sky guard from the east. One, two, declare. One, two, Are you still contact? One, contact yeah, turn left. Okay, you see you see where the um, Nile River or the Suez River terminates into the ocean? Yeah. Okay, to that massive town to the north is Malia. Call contact. Yeah, I got it. It's, I've been flying over that for like the past ten minutes. Okay, the one road that's coming out of the north of the town is an L-shaped road. Call contact. Yeah, I got, yeah, I got it. Okay, right where the turn is to the left, go heading to the west, there are multiple vehicles in the open to the northeast, about a half a mile, call contact. I've been flying over those, it's an armored battalion. Okay, you're, you're clear to engage, just kill them. We, we gotta get out of here. Two, you're clear to kill anything that you see as well, we gotta get out of here within a minute or so. Two. Chalice, one, Panther, one, one, request picture. Panther, one one, Chalice, one picture clear. Three, uh, let's let's do air to air while these guys are attacked. Hey, friend, that's what I've been doing. I'm up at Angels two eight. Chalice. Rifle. Rifle on SA SA nine. One contact is friendly. Visual. Rifle! Right, I'm off to the ocean, to the right. Yeah, visual, visual. Rifle! Right, clock slightly high. Cap flare. Cap flare. Cap flare. Two, rifle times two, off to the sea. Boys, let's let's uh, RTB reference us uh, to your five. Disregard reference us uh, to your four. It's too bad nobody got a tally on it when it actually fired at me. Well, it's a cold launch vehicle, so you don't, you're not going to really see it. Okay. I saw the two missiles uh, following you, but I didn't see any mi uh, SAM trails. Yeah, we were looking. I couldn't see anything. Are you guys referencing Tier 4? Two's referencing Tier 4. I got a spike 3 to my 6. Uh, can I turn around and check my shrike at this thing? Yeah, sure. Three spots in steer four. Uh, three anchor there until uh, two is complete. Hey, friend. Do you see your distance and uh, bearing to steer four? Uh, two is. Sorry, two is uh, four miles off to the west. I understand. All right. I think I'm flying into you now. What's your angel? Uh, two is an angel ten. Uh, checking left.
blind and no contact. Just continue and uh, get your strike off and let's rejoin. I thought we should have said Nighthawk. We should have just used the Suez and the, and the fucking ocean, which I think you were trying to do. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do. That's a better reference than, uh, that was a better idea. Mud two again, right? Left eleven o'clock to the west. Chalice one, Panther one one, declare. Panther one one, Chalice one, contact is friendly. Raygun 067-008-16000. Uh, two, say status. One, answer. One, three. Request a vector to threat. Answer. One, uh, Alice. One, two, searching for AAA. Time. There was a AAA locking me up here that I was trying to get, and I cannot see this thing on my goddamn HAS. Okay, knock it off. Reference tier four. Two. What do Skyguard launchers look like? They look like SA-3s. They're like these rectangular boxes. So I see a group of uh, like Western trucks. That might be... Well, I engaged a group of... Um, on the southwest corner of Ismalia, uh, by a depot, I engaged uh, a group of vehicles that I thought were Skyguards with a GBU. Uh, There's an SA-3. Well... What was the left of an SA-3? Yeah, what's interesting is it's uh, not on the RWR anymore, it may be mobile. Yeah, well, we're, we're RTV. Should have been, should have been out of here about five minutes ago. Hey, firm. Hi, I'm up at Angels 3-1, doing a racetrack. Two is passing over to four right now. Say altitude. Angels one eight. I'm climbing. Blunt. Coming to steer four. Okay, uh, one's at uh, Angels 2-8 and right-hand turn, uh, Stir 4. Blind on 3. You're at Angels 3-1, Nighthawk? Yeah, I, I got you. Coming in on your 9. Now you're 6. Ah, uh, Vigil. Oh, that's the lead. Uh, scratch that. Two is Vigil on somebody. That's fine, let's just RTB. Uh, reference tier one. Check right and reference tier one. And we may land at the abort just to, uh, so we don't troll the rest of the <laughs> fucking package that already landed. I'm gonna right hand turn, I'm getting, uh, buddy spike. Is that a buddy lock or? I was tied uh, with someone. That was probably me. I'm at Angels 26. 
um, referencing steer one, three degree climb. Okay, flight safe fuel. Two fuel, zero three nine. -er. Three zero three eight. Or zero three three. That's weird. It didn't move our abort fields. Uh, I got I got an abort field. There's one about halfway in between two and three. Well, a little less than halfway, but close enough. Now I want I want to land at El Arish, which uh, I've changed in the. Let me get you the bullseye. Bullseye. Give me the bullseye for El Arish. Oh no, there's one at 075114. Is that El Arish? No, it's called something else, but it's 100% in friendly. El Arish should be 076140. Oh, maybe it, maybe we do it at 0.4. 0.11. Yeah, I think it's 0.11. Yeah, let's let's not land. Let's not land at the one you said, Nighthawk. Let's land at uh, eleven. Sorry, right, Afrim. That's a little too close to enemy lines for my liking. Tower Freak is one twenty-one. Try to uh, burn as much as you can without uh, fucking yourself over so we can get on the ground as quickly as possible because uh, the rest of the package is already on the ground. I know that's not SOP, but uh, yeah, I just want to get on the ground as quickly as possible. Are you getting spiked to your six o'clock? Sorry, that was a ray gun call. Ray gun, ray gun, zero seven seven, zero seven three. Chalice one. Is that the one at seven thousand? Declare. Hey, one one. Chalice one. Contact is friendly. It's friendly. Well, I think this tower's on VHF. Actually, forget it. It doesn't matter. No one's gonna be there. No one's landing there. So we can just land. Seems like we killed most of those guns. I should have taken out the two, uh, I, I think I got both of the launcher sets for the SA-3. The one that I was attacking with GBUs?
about seven minutes out from stair 11. Chalice, one Panther, one one. Request picture. Not responding, neither of my doors. I'm like, oh, seriously? That rarely ever happens to me. I don't know what went wrong. So I reconnected. And when I reconnect, I'm about halfway down the runway. And I'm like, oh, shit. So <laughs> so I just hit, you know, full throttle. Thank God I got off. Um, you know, joined up, flew out, steered two, fenced in, needed to flow. We had some bogey calls. Um, saw you guys lost contact, but I saw them. I called them out. Gave you that updated bills there, Gus. And uh, they were 30 miles in, 30 miles hot. So I just, you know, had my flight engaged, burn and turn around, and uh, flow east. Once we flew east for about 40 seconds to a minute, gave some spacing. You guys got up in there and started tangling, and we went ahead and anchored up. Waited for the call for package lead to, you know, give us the green to proceed as fragged. We went, and when he did, we we did that. Somehow the other, <laughs> okay, I want to see this on ICMI, how the other Oka snuck on by. I got to see that. Um, but either way, uh, we went ahead and proceeded as fragged, you know, dropped uh, NOE right before the Suez, crossed the Suez. And as we're crossing, dude, I'm telling you, that was some scary shit because on the RWR, dude, we got shore ads up, like, right ahead. And I'm like, oh, my God. So I'm trying to get in there, you know, thread us in there. And we got in there, and... Uh, made our attack. Apparently, uh, my number three got hit by a man pad on the running. Run out. Um, yeah, apparently, yeah. Uh, number four, you didn't see that? No, what ended up happening was, uh, I ended up with some severe FPS issues right before we turned in, so I was a little bit behind you guys. Your bombs hit first, and it was like a complete smoke screen. Three went through it, and then I went through it, and by the time I got through it, he was already hit. Okay, so either way, we came off from egress, uh, remained in OE till we went, you know, back across Suez, climbed to altitude, had a man kind of low on fuel. I'm not sure we had some fuel issues. Dark, did you end up figuring out what happened there? Um, I don't know. I I dropped my bags uh, when I passed 7,500, and I think it was um when we did that orbit. You said go gate. I was on the outside, so I was like in gate for quite a while just to try and stay in formation with you. Well, I I, I was 350 on the orbit. So that's uh, definitely wasn't. I was gate on the you know on the out, but as soon as I started and began the orbit, I was 350. So that's that's interesting. Either way, um, shit happens. So either way, we came back home, overhead break, landed, no problem. That's us. That's Fury. Next, right. uh, Lobo. Uh, Lobo. So we took off. Hold on one second. And. Uh... Sorry, my kid is being crazy. Uh, yeah, we took off, no issues, got into formation. Um, as we were ingressing, we heard that fight going on, but as I was looking at our path to Faid, I saw nothing. I saw you guys fighting up over the top of the Suez, but we had a clear run all the way to Faid, so I took it. Um, I saw the window and just went. Uh, we had one issue as we were ingressing NOE across the desert. Um, uh, suddenly a tank column just popped into view. Like, I didn't see them on radar. I didn't see them visually when we scanned the area. But when we were probably 10 or 15 miles away, they just appeared on my screen. Like, literally just popped in. Like, you know what I mean? Like, game-style pop-in. Uh, and we had to break right real fast because I was afraid they might have man pads in that tank column. Uh, but we didn't get shot at. Everything was good. Uh, we hit Faid. No real issues. Um, it's completely destroyed. We got locked up by a AAA radar, but never got any shells fired at us, I don't think. Uh, we went back up to Steer 6 and orbited for a little bit to provide air cover. And then uh, my number 2 and my number 4 were pretty low on fuel, so we had to head back to base. And it was pretty uneventful other than that. Cool. Panther. All right. <clears throat> so we got airborne. Um, we had an interesting configuration on the flight. We had a, I had a two GB of 15s. Um, my number two had two Mavericks and a Shrike. Number three and four had Rock Eyes. Um, we were going to destroy the guns on Abu Swayar and then destroy the Sky Guard and um, possibly engage some shit out of Cairo. So uh, we were the first to pick up those bandits, the F4s. Um, we basically uh, 
started to press on them when they got within about 35 miles um, I retrograded southeast um, and then let the let Python deal with them. Pythons had their engaged offensive so then we came around again and were in from the southeast. Um, uh, the element got pretty close. I think they got essentially merged with the furball that was going on but we didn't engage with any uh, heaters. I don't think we got any kills. All the kills were uh, from Python. Once that was complete, we rejoined as a flight. We pressed on to the target area. We attacked uh, from the southeast, and um, we dropped like 12 rock eyes on the on the uh, AAA. I don't I don't know if we actually got any kills. There may have been some weird issue there um, where we didn't get kills for some reason. Um, I dropped a GBU on some guns uh, that were at the airbase. I don't know if those got any kills either. So some really weird behavior going on there. Is that a GBU-15? Yeah. Cool. Um, and I have, like, a video footage of it was armed and it was, you know, directly going to land in the middle of the gun, so I would have destroyed it. Um, same, then, then we were trying to find the Skyguard. Um, gas Man got shot up by the Skyguard. Two missiles were inbound. Uh, got a tally on the missiles. Told him to break. He was able to defend. Then we were looking for the Skyguard for, like, probably ten minutes. Um... And we stayed behind for about five minutes uh, after the military time call was made, which is, uh, I'll take the blame for that, but, yeah, I decided to continue working the target. Um, we weren't able to find the Sky Guard, and then we RTB'd. We did attack some SA-3 launchers and uh, SA-9 and stuff like that with, uh, with Mavericks. Um, I don't think they were effective. I don't think they actually killed anything. So, again, some, I think something weird was going on where the weapons were not destroying anything for some reason i did see an f-15 on egress it was just floating in the middle of the sky so i don't okay. know so yeah some weird shit was happening um and then we rtb'd and we landed at uh at el arish because i didn't want to troll everyone by making them wait so we landed at el arish all right um yeah that's it yeah uh, python uh take off formed up Prepared for a BVR engagement in the Sinai, which uh, didn't come until the very end. Uh, moving in, we had a first group that I, I believe they were getting engaged as we were setting up our engagement on them. They turned north and then we, they trashed on the radar. Uh, a second group to the south of them started pressing in on us and they foxed on us uh, about 15 miles. We uh, went defensive, called the element to engage them. Uh, during this, there was a third group just behind them to the to the west of the southern group. I uh, don't know what happened to them. Like, we'll see an Acme. But uh, we, one and two went defensive. Three and four pressed in. At that point, uh, I believe Panther was also pressing in. And uh, a big merge happened. We killed them all. The The first group that was coming in that, that kicked north, they were shot down, uh, I believe, by some F-15s. So all in all, uh, getting to the target was pretty... Uh, eventful. Uh, once we got to the target, it started becoming a, l a little less eventful. I split the elements. I had one element looking at Faid, one el and then myself and two airbreak were looking at Abu. No scramblers out of them. We saw some helicopters out of Cairo, but no other enemy aircraft. Uh, Faid was taken out pretty quickly, so I moved the element to the south side of Abu, and we took the north side of Abu and just orbited. Uh, then it was hit. We called a SAM launch a little too late, and someone, I don't know, someone was hit, I think Orion. Um, but that was it. I don't know who else was hit in the package, or who else was shot down. Was anyone else shot down? Says Orion. That's it? Okay. Uh, then once uh, I knew Lobo was already RTB, and then Fury, once you called uh, Dakota, and you were done with the attack, and then I called Mellow Time. Um... I didn't get a confirmation. I knew Brainling was already RTB. Fluky, you gave me a confirmation RTB. I didn't know if Panther heard the call, so I repeated it, and I didn't hear it again. But uh, I figured, hey, we just got to get out of here now. So we got out. Looks like you guys did stay behind. Um, if something were to jump to you, we wouldn't have been able to help you out, but I guess you knew that. Um, you were, I guess you were staying behind to look for the uh, Skyguard that we told you about. Okay, and you just couldn't find it. Okay.
I I put the sky guard on my beam, my nine beam, and I looked out the the window, and there was a, there was a huge formation, and I and I zoomed in, and there was an SA three. I was thinking, I was kind of thinking, like, why is there a sky guard right on this SA three? Gotcha. Gotcha. Anyway, that's it for Python. Great job. Everyone, Lawman, welcome, by the way. First flight, did really well on his first flight. Thank you. Enjoyed it. Okay, guys, um, let's do the Acme debrief. Uh, the, the quick debrief's over, so if you guys want to leave, go ahead. But we're going to do a longer uh, Acme debrief and kind of see what was going on there. Uh, I'll repost everything. Wait, wait, wait. We're using your uh, uh, ACM, I guess? No. Mm -hmm. Look, I don't know what the hell ACM I got here. The one I linked. Okay, well, I just... Oh, what the fuck? Alright. Let's start it off. So, um... The escort, we didn't get into the uh, into the pit until, I don't know why, the, the timing was a bit off. We were kind of late coming in, so uh, it looks like uh, one of the Okas and the Sea took off. Uh, we got into there as quick as we could, and we pressed up. And we saw that there's a bunch of 16s in front of us, so I'm assuming that was you guys. Leading the package was uh, Fluky. Followed was by I leading Cross. the package? <laughs> Yeah, I, uh, I, don't, I don't know how that happened, because we were at, on Carrot. We were actually ahead of Carrot by like a minute at some points. Yeah, I was I was on Carrot back here. Uh, where was I? Did that have to do because of the uh, issue with the AI taking off a, a little bit earlier, or...? I don't know. That was weird, though. I was just, I was just flying Carrot, and I'm, I'm, I was looking... On the radar, and I saw you guys up here. Up here, I'm just kind of kind of worried when we saw the F force coming in. But anyway, so I was gonna tell you guys. So we saw the three groups. Uh, the first group kicked north. Let me zoom up to them. Yeah, I took these... my sorry ass backwards to the east when I when that shit happened. So the BBR engagement. These guys kicked north and became a non-factor as we were pressing in from from the east here. Um, but then these guys they turned into us. And I'm going to see what happened to these guys. I guess these guys also joined in the merge a, a bit late. So I'm going to watch from these guys, uh, this point of view. So you can see us. We're we're currently retrograding. Yeah, yeah. Running away. Good, good idea. The F-15 cap. It was pressed in on engagement. Okay. So that's why they went north, and we lost them off radar right about here. Because they die, I'm sure. So, sitting here... Um, I got the I got these guys kicking north, and I, and I see these other two groups out here, and I say, all right, one and two, we're gonna take the, the northern group. Element, you continue with the other group that's behind them. So, Apex takes uh, takes Lawman, and they're gonna prosecute the other group while I'm, I'm checking out what's happening with these guys. Oh, I didn't know you were doing that because I thought you were engaging. I thought you were engaging this, the other group. Oh, fuck. This group up here. Yeah. That's yeah, we were. Uh, but and then and then we start when you said you were. Engage. We turn around. We start engaging the group that was at twenty-five thousand, which is this group. I put the element on them because I, I didn't know what what, they're, what these guys were doing. They were dragging us away, and when, once I realized, hey, these guys are are, are just dragging us away. Holy shit! These these are friendlies. Then the group behind them that I got the I got the element on, uh, engage us with Fox Ones. Holy shit! <laughs> oh my god! Uh, we defend the Fox Ones. Is that the AI bar cap shooting at aim sevens at them? 
Uh, that serpent. Yep, that's the other uh, kill flight. <laughs> Dude, they almost hit you with some clean tactic there, man. Uh, I broke I broke the lock right away with some chaff. So, um, turn back in. The element were led by Apex and Lawman are pressing in. And I guess we, we get into a, uh, it starts off as a Fox one fight, turns into a, a pretty big merge. Oh, how did that Fox one not hit? Chat Fox? Fox? Yeah, the, the Fox, the, yeah, the AM7 Fox trots currently have a 50% chance of eating chaff for every uh -huh. chaff bundle. Yeah. When we rebuild this theater, we're probably going to fix that. Ooh, gets a good hit. one. There we go. He didn't. He didn't chaff. He might have been out. He was dumping chaff like a motherfucker a second ago. Yep. Yeah. 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 True. Before this, even he was dumping. Ooh, we got the double tap. <laughs> but we still got three more F fours. Um, we have to deal with these guys. So what is my flight doing right now? Because at one point. Nighthawk was in hot. Start from the, the beginning of the engagement. So you guys, yeah. at the start of the engagement, the draggers, you guys are back here. No, this is after we turned in, after we were already defensive. This is when we were sorted on the second group. Okay. So Nighthawk, so, at this point, is, is deep. He should be my, he should be in my 2 o'clock. Back it up all the way? Yeah. So you're, so you're retro, retro? Turn back in. Yeah, we that's, when, for... that's when we were sorted. We were sorted on these guys. Mm-hmm. And then we we asked for assistance right away. Uh, we I called uh, we're defensive now. The element does a fox one shot misses, and then you guys press in. With yeah. Serpent. So at this point, pause it for a second. So at this point, um, I re I saw they were dragging. So then, I told Nighthawk to attack them. So I'm currently out, and Nighthawk should be in. Okay, looking at Nighthawk. Oh no, he's sorted on a different group. I think he sorted on the wrong group. Yep. These guys uh, completely disappeared on my radar. So the Just... only guys I saw were these. There was the other group. So I thought that's what who you're talking about. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, I think... Wow. And, then, and then Nighthawk, you, you merge into this merge into this furball, right? I think... Well, we try to, but they all die before we get there. Fox 1. Like, one so I'm guy. scanning at that moment, at that exact moment, I see them visual. So this, like this guy in specifically, over there, he he goes dirty fingernails. So I see the orange tab, so I press in, but they all die. Holy shit! That was wow, close. that was close. Over, that dude. was fucking close. And I, yeah, I was, it was, it was, <laughs> dude, it was so dirty fingernails. Dude, it was so <laughs> dirty, and I just man. pressed in, and I almost cracked lawman again. What the fuck? Oh god. <laughs> Again. But that's one tight Ooh. turn there. Jeez. Look at this clusterfuck. Uh, Lawman would have been fucking dead right there. Definitely saved Lawman's life right there. Watch that's, this shit. Let's watch Lawman. Watch the bandit. Watch the bandit on Lawman 6 right here. Oh, oh yeah. Put the oh, brakes on. Put the brakes on. Oh, right, put right, the right, 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 right. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, he was actually burning at that point. Oh, he was? Visually. He came, yeah. He came tumbling down, burning, and ejected. Which one? This guy stalled out. It was this guy. Yeah. Oh yeah, maybe it was the guy, guy from his point of view. He wants air break. Why is he what is he time? doing? 120 knots. I don't know what he's doing. He's 24,000 feet. He locks up air break. He still wants air break. But he tries to go on me, and I go vertical. And then he's like, "All right, I got to find my new guy. Who's my new guy?" Is it Apex? No, it's Lawman. He's already dead. <laughs> so I mean, he he was turning on you, right? Like it looked like he was, he was oh, gonna yeah. line up a shot, probably, but then died. And that's the air air. That, that's all of the air air that happened. Yeah. Yeah. When I heard all that shit happening, I was like, "Oh shit, man! I'm I'm sure they'll be all right." I right. kept faith, but I was a little like, so, "Damn." Dude, so right now we so were far. we were clearing the air behind you, and then but then we start. Going because we were going to attack the target from the southwest or disregard southeast, so we're returning back to the ingress route. Gotcha. I got Apex and Lawmen, they're going to meet up at a steer point down here and start orbiting Faid, uh, looking for scramblers. Uh, whereas Airbreak and I, we're, we're going to just we're at Abu now, we're checking out Abu. Um, 
this is where right around here I say um, all right I got the sky guard off to my left nine o'clock and it's it's an sa3 <laughs> and uh, I see this and I'm, I'm thinking yeah. is, this, is this the sky guard this is the group we attacked out? like if you and I thought that flat face was the sky guard radar this is it the annoying thing is that this is exactly where we briefed it but I the thing is because you said it was moving, I didn't look at the position that we briefed. It wasn't moving, no. Someone said it was moving, and I was like, okay, cool, um, it's no longer where I was briefed. And I didn't even look here, but we briefed here. Yeah, so I looked at my 9 line, because it was right at the, you know, the, the beam of the RWR, and this is what I saw on the beam of the RWR, and if I just looked. So who's, little... someone said it was moving. I don't know who, but someone said it was moving. I probably said it was moving. And then... Because of that, I just I knocked it off completely, and I was focusing on supporting the attack on the airbase. Okay. Um, and then after that, I was like, all right, let's find the Skyhawk. But it was I should have just looked at what we briefed. <laughs> Go back a little bit, guys. Back, 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 back. Holy shit, you guys. So are... this this is the part where you said ev orbit or whatever, but I saw where the fight was and I knew it wasn't. So that's why you said, going. I want to continue. And I was yeah. like, no, don't continue. There's a big ass fight about to happen. There's three groups, but I, I, I figured you knew best from where you were, wherever you were. Yeah. Um, I could see the whole thing from where I was. So I right. decided to go ahead and we were going to hit the deck anyways. I, and you guys, for some had reason, I, th I thought you were up here and you were asking to continue from up uh -uh. here. No, I was all the way was, back here at the time. It was just like, no, 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 so no. So I could no. see the whole fight. So I knew what was going on. So that's why I just cleared us in. Cause I was like, I mean, I understood why you made the call you made, but I had a, think I had a slightly better picture of the entire Maybe battlefield. Like, like orbit is a bad call. Maybe just say go, go safe. <laughs> Maybe yeah, maybe, a new, yeah. A new brevity word, go safe, which means to stay out of the fight. So you'll notice, you don't see this tank battalion we're about nah, to pass over. just retrograde it's... orbit. Retrograde orbit. This not here. Let's yeah, go not back. Here. So we're, we're NOE at this point, and we're cruising along, tooting through the desert, and then, bang, right there I see this tank battalion pop up right along our flight path. <laughs> oh, that would have been bad. Everyone gets well. Everyone's kind of split up. Yeah, I will. Well, I called a pretty for you, hard and a stinger for you and yeah, a stinger I, for everybody. I called a pretty hard break at that point because I didn't want us to fly over that battalion. It's a good call. It probably saved every one of you. And now here's your attack plan. Yeah, and then I cleared uh, Domestus and Jigsaw to do their thing, and then me and um, Poison hit the runway. All right, let's see this. What was the plan? This, what you see right here. <laughs> no, well, Domestos and Jigsaw, what were they doing? Uh, they were hitting fuel tanks and... Uh, I don't remember what else. Hangar, I think? That's that was, that was a beautiful... Who's, who's your number two? Poison. That was a pretty beautiful defensive jink on the, on the egress. Watch this. This is fucking beautiful. Let's see that zoomed in. Good camera angle here. Go down. I don't know about. I mean, I'm not trying to rain on his parade, but he shouldn't have gained altitude. He should have stayed low. Is Jigsaw good? Mm, yes and no. You want to gain a little altitude because you want to change your aspect to anything firing at you. Fucking Pope. <laughs> I'll change your aspect now. I guess he gets like the ammo dump or something. Yeah, he had to reattack. His bombs didn't come off, but he got it the second time through, I think. Nope. Okay. Or not. Third, th third attack was a charm. <laughs> Alright, well, he got it eventually. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, and then you guys uh, choose to do some cap. or Yeah, we went back to Steer 6 and orbit. Well, they are TV. Uh, but, uh... In case, well, yeah, we went back to Steer 6 and orbit, and that's me and uh, poison over there, just in case you guys needed us. And then Poison called that he was Joker, and that's when I said we had about two minutes of play time, and you sent us home. Yeah, just, yeah, just go home. Uh, anyway, so that's the Faid. Let's take a look at uh, Fuki. Faid is fucked. <laughs> Let's take it back from the beginning. Take it back from the beginning. Take it back. Is this good, or further? For, big, further. Before the orbits. All right, there we go. I was not aware I was leading the package, if I indeed was actually leading the package. 
For some sure reason, yeah, it's, happened there. it's had, you out, had you out in front. Yeah. So, we're flowing in. What was your takeoff time? Oh, uh, I can't remember now. Uh, we were seven feet up a little. Right to the, to, there we go. So, yep, we got some contacts. I called them in. They were within range. I was like, yeah, we're going the other way. They're getting a little close for comfort. They turned hot on us. So I was like, let the cap deal with it. As we flow out, you see everybody flows past Blue us. Blue angels. That was a good turn. I mean, I didn't feel like continuing um, to go, you know, I didn't feel safe to continue to press or whatnot. And I just knew there was a lot of shit. And be, you know, there was enemy in the way of me and my uh, my target, so I just waited for it to clear, play the safe. I didn't want to have to get tangled up and then have to force to jettison the, my load, and then that there goes my mission. So I just played it safe. Once that was clear, we continued on. Went uh, anyway right before the the water here. Oh, traffic! I didn't see them. <laughs> TCAS alert. Pull up. That's low. We drop him retarded. Yep. Not low. That's why I like low it. is skimming your tanks on the treetops at like 50 feet. Yeah, usually I have trees to, to help me guide it <laughs> to judge to see how low I am, but I didn't. So, yeah, as when I turn in here, man, I'm getting, you know. Seen all this? I'm like shit. I mean, uh, <laughs> but, but rewind, rewind a little bit because I think Nighthawk wiped out. The like a, okay. They wiped out like a huge swath of AAA right before. You said final. you guys were rebombing. So this, Tiger this is fires. this is the most dangerous. This is the most dangerous AAA right here because they're right across the thresholds. These guys. Nice. Good shit. Yeah. So I, you know, I just saddle up. Pretty much hold, held on to my butt. <laughs> so can we? Can we? Uh, can I have a control for a second? Yeah, that sky guard is. I want to understand broken. what happened with this. Hey man, what is what? a spy? Is that a missile or the radar? Yeah, it, the it's the name of it. All right, so the it plan, never even really gets supersonic. Plan plan was is we we were going to attack this AAA from the southeast. So the final attack heading should be something like this. Let's see what happens here. Right, we should have finished my attack and then gone back to you, man. All right, whatever. <laughs> take go to go, go ahead. I'm just saying. Take it, take it back and do it. You're just chronologically after us, so it doesn't really make much sense. But go for it. Retro, you know, we we'll replay. I'm just the attack. It's almost over. You know. Continue. Slowing it down. So how many man pads are in this area? I don't know. I'm shitting bricks though, so I'm dropping flares. As I should, I. You know, I, I was very clear. I was like, hey, guys, you know, trail, let's look out for man pads. So I drop shit, pull hard as, as I, I can away. Probably a little too hard, actually, because I end up flying over. But either way, so focus on uh, three there, number three. There you Boom. go. I, <laughs> me and Dark were like, don't drop below 800. I said drop 1,000. He ended up dropping it to whatever. He took a hit. Boom. Frag, right there. Fragged himself, fragged himself, fragged himself. Yeah. Oh yeah, he didn't get hit by and the man then, pad. And then, no, he did. No, no, he does. What the and fuck? This. It's the but second time in a row. <laughs> look at that motherfucker shot. Hold on though, we, you're you're doing three G's. You know when what you happens? Hit, man. It, you gotta it pull hard. It loses him and then it finds it. him. Right, no, but you, know, you don't have to watch. You, see, no, no. you saw how I pulled. We're gonna watch you from just, this guy's point of view. No, no, you don't come off soft. Period. Ever. Because that's what happens. There it goes. There guys. Got him. And to, to reinforce what Fluky is saying, I actually broke my jet pulling off on the egress because you need to really, really I want to really see pull. that missile perspective. If you could go to like the first person missile. Had you been Try pulling it. max pull, you might have gotten, you might have lived. Who knows? Yep. All right, no, guys. And then go to like the HUD camera yep. view. Yep. Did oh. you lose control when you fragged yourself? Yeah, I think I've already lost some of my. Uh, <laughs> That's just that bad was pulling, luck. That I was pulling is max quite literally bad luck because it loses him here, heavy. so it goes ballistic. Because look at the G's, then it finds him again. So oh, I think probably because my um, my uh, attitude control was probably limited. Yeah, that was pretty crazy. So either way, so we flow out, then boom, the rest is uneventful. All right. It. Anyway, back to uh, the Kraus. Yeah, give me control. More control. Yeah. So I want to go over. So so Nighthawk, are you are you in here? I'm in here. 
What, what, I'm ready. I don't see you on the list. Are you you're watching the ACMI right now? I am. I wanna. I wanna see like, Check the right, right hand side. There's some Look. lesson. There's some lessons to learn here. Um. So our our plan was to attack from the southeast. So the final attack heading should be like this. Um. I'm just gonna skip myself. I wanna see what happens with them with the element here. So where, what I was trying to do here is but, I was I was scanning the airbase. Is it, is it before this? It's not before this, is it? Yeah. No. Nah, yep. Hold on. I think you said there's a massive line and you could take them all out in one pass. You just have to get lined up. So we were getting lined up. <laughs> mm-hmm. That's exactly what we did. Yeah. Where are you guys? Behind you. Zoom out. Zoom out. Zoom out. Oh, I see you now. Okay. There you go. Yeah. So this this position that you guys are overflying is the brief. This sky guard, which is right here is the briefed position of the sky guard that we had in the briefing. Yeah, that's right where we put the damn steer point. Yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah I have and the SA-13 in the... And then we also, yep. we're attacking from the east rather than the southeast, so what happens here is, is it's only luck that you didn't get shot by the AAA and the sky guard that was here at Nighthawk, they just were probably not turned yep. on yet. No, yep. that's what that's why I climbed up high and I had an SA-13 marker here that I skimmed. Yeah, I, so, yeah. Uh, so that's why... That's why I called the climb up to high altitude, and that's why I also stayed a bit more left than Gasman did. Yeah. So, the, so what happens here is, is um, so there's a key point as well that happened before this, which is, I think it was Gus said that he he saw a moving sky guard. So what what that caused me to do is, our planned mission was to the plan was I was going to hit the sky guard uh, using a GBU fifteen. Because I was told, oh, there's a moving sky guard, I just uh, I abandoned that plan. Then we tried to have number two shoot a strike at the sky guard, but he couldn't. There's no tape. The sky guard's not on the table, so he wasn't able to engage it. So then I was trying to find it visually, and that's what you see here. So um, right now I'm trying to visually find the the sky guard, and then when I am unable to find the sky guard, I then start looking at the runway because I'm trying to prepare number three and number trying to prep number three and number four to run in. I get a good contact on the AAA right here, and that's where I start giving them target information. Um, and then at at this point, these guys are running in. Maybe they're a little, maybe you guys are a little too eager because, you, because I was saying it was such a good run or something. But we still got to respect the final attack heading, which is southeast. Like even if even if you're trying to deconflict from the threats by going high, Nighthawk, I still would have come in from the southeast and then did a quick final onto west or whatever that is. But um, what we did instead is we overflew some brief threats. Um, and I, what I should have honestly done is just said this area is a restricted airspace. I had it marked. I just spaced out and just That's fine. got fixated. That's fine. So I, you're you're coming on to final. When you come on to final, this happens. Me and um, Star Fury, who are like in a really good position to see the SAM launch. You see how we're tilting right here? We're trying to see where this launch is. We're trying to look for the launch. And right now, like, we just couldn't see it. There was no SAM trail. It was, it was a, looked like a cold launch, which I don't think is realistic, but we couldn't see it. And at this point, I see the, the yellow orbs flying in the air. That's how I saw them, and that's what I told you to break. So right now, you're continuing like this, and I think I tell you to, at one point, to break, break, right. break right. Yep, right here is where the break right call is. That did the trick. And that, that pretty much did that. And then... Um, so the sky, so the two sky guards were defended, and at this point, again, because I still think I still think the sky guard is mobile. I'm not even looking at this. So that was like a big. So we really need to make sure when we get when we say something on the radio, it's it's true, uh, because I I was looking over here. People were saying they saw sky guard moving along the road over here. So that's what I was looking for. I was looking for a sky guard over here. And meanwhile, if I would have just followed my brief plan, I would have killed it, guaranteed. So. Um, we come around now, and during that, during so let's go back to the actual attack by Nighthawk. So Nighthawk's attack is pretty effective, um, and I believe if Gasman would have been able to continue, he would have his would have been very effective too. And I think we would have killed uh, all of these guns here, and then that would have uh, possibly made the attack a little bit safer. Um, after the attack, I think Nighthawk is just yeah. So again, we're up here because we're thinking that there is a sky guard here because that's what someone said on the radio. So we're we're looking over here for a sky guard. Um, Gasman comes in for another attack, and I think as he's attacking, uh, I believe I drop a GBU um, on the. So again, cleaning up, trying to find where the Sky Guard is. Find, uh, I'm like, fuck this, I give up. I'm just going to attack the the. Uh, just going to. So I think 
at one point, Fluky here, who is it? Yeah, I think Fluky. Yeah, yeah. Fluky said he was in hot. So I come around, and once I see that the last ship is off, I release a GBU with the intention of uh, destroying the launcher, uh, the guns that are here. And uh, we'll see how that turns out. I had a really good um, target lock. I don't know if it actually kills anything, but. I, uh, I think it did. I think you got a whole bunch of stuff. And we'll see. Yeah, you did it. It blew up gloriously right in the middle. Um, and it, uh, yeah, well, let's see what happens here. I guess I kill two guns. And then, um, I think Gasman does another attack onto the guns, right? Yeah, flying over the Sky Guard again, oh, like three times, probably. <laughs> one Rock Eye. And are you, are you Winchester at this point? Or no, I just, uh, pickling off one at a time was... Okay, so you're just doing, like, an orbit and you're doing, is that a detoss delivery? Yeah, detoss. Yeah, yeah. definitely. I think your fusing might be fucked though, right? I don't think you get No, any they kills. worked. They they worked. Oh, you did get kills? Yeah, they all worked. Um, I think that was a good um that was a good tactical decision, not not uh using CCIP and doing DDoS deliveries. That was probably good because there's so much shit here. Look at all this shit. So you do a couple more of these. I still um, should have attacked from the south like we briefed though, you know. That's fine. Another learning point I want to go over, um, which is pretty big, is um, this feature here is Ismalia, and it's a very distinctive feature. And uh, we briefed this. We briefed two steer points that are related to this feature in the briefing. Um, but it seemed like only myself and Nighthawk were able to like visually tally this feature, and that caused about a seven-minute delay where we were trying to walk our respective wingmen onto this target. So right here... I had a ta well, I don't know where it was in the in the timeline, but I had a tally on these vehicles here, and that was roughly corresponding to the uh, mud, the mud mud uh, skyhawks. So we thought that this was the, um, we thought that these were the skyhawks, or skyguard rather. So I was trying to call this in for like at least seven minutes, and there's only one road to coming out of the north of the. Uh, so I kept saying, okay. Reference the northern road coming out of Ismalia, um, and then it makes it. This actually makes an L-shaped hook. I don't know why it doesn't show it on the map, but this makes an L-shaped hook going to the west, or it's actually like right here. And we are trying to reference this this uh, position, um, and we took a long time to do that because uh, we were having issues with the with the sort of sand table preparations. Yeah, I I thought all, you were talking about all the stuff to the east of that coming out of East Ismalia. I had that road, but I couldn't see the um, what you were calling out. I could not see those things for the life of me. Do you have smart scaling on? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I could see everything else. I just didn't see those particular units. Okay. I think, like, right here. Yeah, I think right here is where I... Uh, it's not right here. It's a little bit after this. So right now, like, I think the Miller time call is right around here. Yeah, people are starting to egress. And I'm like, I want to kill this fucking Skyguard. That's my current mission. So we, we, we had a contact on this, and I thought that this was the Sky Guard. I was trying to do the the three the nine line thing that uh, the the three nine line thing that Gus was talking about. I thought that this was the Sky Guard, and I thought that this radar was the actual Sky Guard radar. So we I drop a GBU on this, um, and during this time, Gasman's continuing to do uh, DTOS attacks onto the AAA. Um, so I destroy part of this battalion. And then I was trying to tell uh, number two to get a tally on this and and engage them. And I don't. Yeah. Then me and him call out. Now yeah, that was the partially destroyed SA three battalion. Yeah. I remember we were... it from the briefing. Yeah. And this is the point where I think I spot these guys, and I'm like, okay, I'm trying to vector people onto this target for like five or six minutes. Um, and finally, what I did is I said, okay, fuck it. You you don't have a you don't have a tally on the on this reference. Fucking flow to steer four, get me, lock me up, and then I then I referenced the target steer points that we had, and then walked him on that way. And then they did uh, Maverick attacks, and I let's see those actual attacks. You know what we? Uh, uh, you could probably like mark point it and like read out coordinates if we're okay. skinned worse. Yeah, so they're attacking the wrong target, <laughs> but that's fine. Yeah, I mean. Look at all the roads going north out of the city. There's one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so this isn't north though. This is east. That's east, yeah. But it yeah. goes north. It goes north out of the city. Well, it looks like that on this map. It's a north-south road. <laughs> it looks like that on it looks like that on this map, but in 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 the game, it didn't look like this. It looked like it looked. This was the only one that was coming out to the north. 
Um, so anyway, you guys kill things. So that's better than not killing things, I guess. So they they maverick some things. Um, let's Star Fury's attacking the SA three battalion. And yeah, guess, what the hell happened to those? So it could be. Let's see what your. So you, the angle here is a little. Okay. It was a little steep, but I had a nice solid cross. They came off just fine. Yeah, that looks fine. Your attack parameters look fine. And they just didn't get a kill? No, uh, yeah, BMS showed no kills. Did Gasman get a kill? No, his shit didn't kill anything oh, either. Go back uh, and one watch of them. Did. Oh, that yeah, one I got did. a kill. I over g it. Yeah, what? I was defending the Skyrim. That one misses. What the hell? Probably because you were too close or something, or you didn't get a good lock. Watch the uh, first one. Hmm. It's guiding. Nope. Yes. Bell, you defuse? Hard to say. Yeah, maybe you over at some point and then... Maybe. Jesus. Let's see, do you ever break like five and a half keys? Uh, I was kind of pushing <laughs> on it at one point. Even though it's not realistic, DCS Mavericks are godlike. Yeah, that that could have been an issue as well. Is if you're outside of the key, that's a good point, Brainly. Um, I I was definitely not outside the keyhole. Yeah, it looked like it had good parameters. So. And he had solid cross, right? Go to the right? head not view. Go cross. To the, yeah, go solid to the cross. View. I mean, I haven't missed a maverick shot, and I don't remember how long. Yeah, for uh, Crass, go to the HUD view. Okay, stand by. Yeah, and so that should give you an approximate angle. Mm. I mean, that's. Under ten degrees. That's borderline, but it's, it's pretty much in the keyhole. I think you sh I think your nose should That's have been fine. down a couple more, but it should be fine. Remember, the keyhole skinnies up near the bottom. But look so how it's a keyhole. But look how high this this. I mean, this is borderline. Like I wouldn't have known. Like if I was flying, I would have made the same. Yeah, mistake. I wouldn't have known either. Yeah, oh, yeah. But but I think if you look at where it's launched, like look at look at the. This is a really extreme angle. Uh, between the. I mean. Like I don't, I don't look think you did anything yeah. wrong, Star Fury. I would have fired that. I would have, too. I would have done the same thing. But it, look at the, that's a pretty extreme angle, dude. Look at it from this angle. Yeah, but I nosed over before I pickled. That is true. I mean, but if you look at, go back to the HUD view. The yeah. missile hits the target, but just doesn't look, look kill where, it. Look where, look. So look where the target is. The keyhole is basically inside your range tapes, like, and then it fattens up at the top, right? If you see what I'm saying. Yeah, it's like it's like a bell. Yeah, so I think like you that. were yeah. slightly, and I mean slightly, outside the keyhole at the bottom. But I would have fired the that maverick too. The second shot was outside of it. Yeah, I mean I would have fired that maverick too. So, actually, this one looks like it's inside. If if he fired, well, no, but it's it, too never close now. it never tracks. See? Look. Yeah. And I think the I think the set, the first one was just a failure, just a regular good old failure. If you look at Gasman's, his first one misses too. Or it, or, it, or it hits, but it doesn't kill it for some reason. And Where's my keyhole at? <laughs> Let's see. This is pretty. This is pretty good. This is a pretty good approach. I would yeah, say. Yeah, I mean, this is just farther on. away. But no, you're. It's not just but further you're, away. Well, you're, you're, you're. See how this is twenty degrees nose down here. This before for um, Star Fury was like thirty-five degrees. Yeah, I well because I was closer. Yeah. What'd you just fire at? It's something over here, I think. Oh, that was, might have been outside the keyhole then, because you were it, at a weird angle. It it wasn't. It's the the seeker looks to the left and right. You're it's not exactly where your nose is pointed. No, but if you look at how the keyhole acts, like it's slim at the bottom and fat at the top. It hits though. So. Uh, it, it hits. It just the failure uh, to those fuse. Are SA9. Those are SA nines. It's, it's a failure to fuse. We had two failure to fuse. Kill the kill the T sixty two. I it's very possible I over G'd. I, I was pushing right up on that five and a half mark at one point. I did over G I had station failures. So stuff. you actually have to basically aim your nose uh, on your target that you want to hit to it, No, it doesn't have to be perfectly aimed on, but you need to like be able to mentally There's... picture what the keyhole looks like in your head. Okay. If anyway. someone could like find that image yeah, yeah, I'll pull it up. in the Discord, yeah. Yeah, well, I can tell you that the cross was exactly in the middle of the keyhole, even though my nose wasn't pointed. So your nose doesn't have to be pointed exactly. It's where the cross is on the, the MFD. My cross was right in the middle, which yeah. is the key, yeah. in the middle of the keyhole. I, I would say that particular missile probably had an over G fault, would be my guess. Possibly. Though, I guess. though like, technically, yeah. uh, Mavericks only have a warhead because if they are off slightly, they normally kinetically 
will kill things. You, you can take uh, you can take it, Gus. I don't have anything. Oh, else. No, I just wanted to show you guys uh, two pictures. Uh, so we're over guys hosting, I guess, the a LAN event, and he's got United Operations Air Force uh, on the the <laughs> cockpit. <laughs> That's amazing, dude. Wow. That is absolutely amazing. Wow. I wonder what that text says. He wrote a blurb about it. He wrote a whole paragraph. Oh, he's yeah. <laughs> Don't read that, man. Amazing. There has to be a better image. It should say the greatest uh, air force in Western history, or something. <laughs> um. Anyway, yeah. So, do you guys have any feedback or questions about that? The 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 two learning lessons I just brought up, like basically target study and. and yeah. So, um. In reference to the target study, it would be really nice. Uh, I know past frags, we've had a lot more info in the actual frag that we could look at beforehand. This one kind of just had the one overhead. Um, but yeah, I guess what I could I guess what I could have done is like I could have just quickly taken a screenshot of the of the three D and then marked up some roads. But from my perspective, like I think the one thing that me and Nighthawk realized that we fucked up on. Is uh, we were trying to we were trying to give you guys references to his Malia, and we were, probably what we should have done is said, okay, you see where the Suez Find the terminates, big, like lake. Yeah, you see where the Suez terminates into the ocean. Okay, call contact. Then we should have guided them on. Because yeah, we, that's that's what I was trying to do at the end, but we ran out of time. Yeah, that that <laughs> would have been better. Yeah, yeah, the first. Yeah, I didn't realize how how hard it was to walk Cause... people on. I had visual on that SA-3, and that's why I was, because I was sitting there looking at that, I'm like, oh, no, those are SA-3 launchers, and you're, and that was what you were trying to, to um, cite us in on the first time, so I'm like, no, that can't be it, what the hell am I looking at? Did you ever see the road that was going north out of the city? It's really Yeah, and I, I saw that road, and I'm sitting there looking over that road, I just didn't see, and I could saw, see him on TACView, I just did not see those units up there to the northeast where you were calling them out. Gotcha. All right, I'm done. So if you want to take over Gus or whatever. Oh, nope, shutting it down.